What's going on everybody? My name is Steven. You guys are watching the Fowler Air Gun Channel. Check it out guys. Webley Nemesis PCP converted pistol here. Some of you have seen this. This is the revised edition here. Fancy new gauge. Got a nice large cocking lever here on the side. And I am topped here on the end with our Hug It Mini Magna for our uh, moderator. Keep things nice and quiet for us. And uh, you'll see I got my bulk air fill. I'd really like to have a nice 3D pin, uh, printed piece that could cover that up. So that'll be next on the to-do list. But anyways, I got the uh, chronograph out here today. What I want to explain to you I have going on is uh, this isn't just a PCP converted pistol. I've also been working on a little bit of a project. So inside of this has this valve technology that is completely ran off of magnetic repulsion instead of ran off of uh, uh, spring repulsion, I guess how you would call it, or tension rather. And so uh, that allows a lot of freed up space inside the valve. I haven't tuned this thing with the hammer. I haven't done a whole lot of balancing this stuff yet. So uh, that's to do. Uh, kind of playing around with different magnet strengths, different magnet sizes, things like that. I'm kind of narrowing down exactly what does and does not work. With that being said, we do have a functional prototype here to test out today. I'm going to be airing up probably somewhere close to 2500 PSI into this thing. So a lot of air. And I don't know how much of a squeeze it's going to put on here. We've got kind of some light duty magnets. Uh, they're a 5x5 five five millimeter uh, neodymium magnets, I believe is how you would pronounce that. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and shoot us a couple numbers over the chronograph and just uh, plink around a little bit right out here, maybe out to like 40 yards a little bit with some of these uh, Crossman Premier Hollow Point standard 14.3 grain pellets. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, get shooting may or may not be able to see right there we are aired up to about a little bit closer towards that 3000 psi area but yeah crossman premier hollow points here standard 14.3 grain pellet let's check some velocities here 642 feet per second that's fairly respectable 595 all right now that we got that out of the way let's go ahead and just do a little bit of shooting right here and see what we can hit out here just out to 40 yards, nothing fancy here, open sights. I'm actually blocked by this can. It's a bit larger, so no big deal, but it still uh, makes for a lot of fun shooting. Nice and quiet. All right, guys, well, there you have it. Just kind of messing around with the prototype a little bit here. Again, I haven't gotten it dialed in or anything. But uh, shooting again with the Hug It Mini uh, Magna there, keeping us nice and quiet and uh, best as you can anyways with such a short barrel. Uh, like I said, this is still just kind of prototype and working a lot of things out of it, but this is a much better rendition of uh, my version of the Magnetic Valve PCP Converted Webley Nemesis. It's a whole lot of fun. It's a really great package. I know a lot of people have seen this, have asked me, like seem kind of obsessed over this uh, platform here, but uh, <clears throat> it's just so fun to convert over and play with. It's a nice lightweight uh, polymer design, so it just works really well for me. Uh, I could have done this, you know, construction and anything. I'm probably gonna take this technology and actually put it into a rifle next and just see with some larger uh, valve area, bigger valve area, much more of a valve area to work with for larger magnets. I should be able to have more area to kind of tune, so I'm gonna try a rifle with this technology next. But anyways, just wanted to bring this out and uh, show you guys and. Let you know that I'm still out here tinkering around with these things all the time, air guns, and I uh, got some more videos coming for you soon. So I hope you enjoyed this one. If you do, do me a favor, guys, give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more from it, guys. And as always, I will see you on the next one.